this video if you're new welcome to my channel today we are going to do swatches with a palette that I really really like I've been using it for a couple of days now and I'm just in love with it and I'm talking about the palette that I've mentioned in one of my other videos and it's Violet Voss Laura Lee palette now I really 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 love Laura Lee I watch every of her videos I think she's funny I think she's cool and um, she's very good at, work, at makeup so I bought this palette because I saw her using it and I saw other videos and makeup looks with this palette and I just thought I need this in my collection so I've been trying to get my hands on this for a very very long time and uh, when I, it got possible for me to order it to Sweden I was so happy so that's what I have on my eyes today. Eye makeup doesn't look perfect because I've been wearing this look for a whole day. So the only thing that I touched right now before filming is my lips lipstick. Then the rest of my makeup look is what I had for almost, well at least, let me see, more than 12 hours. So I'll be wearing this makeup for over 12, 12 hours. And uh, let me just show you this palette. This is how it looks. It has a big beautiful mirror and this is the shadows. And let me say the pigmentation is amazing. It really shows off on the eyelids and easy to blend. The only issue I had is with this basic eyeshadow. I found it a little bit powdery. Or if, if I pronounce that right, it's, it's, it's a good eyeshadow, but it just looks like I had a lot of powder on, on my eyelids. And I tried to use it under my eyebrows, and it looked better, but I really had to blend it out because it looked powdery when you look up close. So that's the only eyeshadow I cannot think it's me. And these other shimmery eyeshadows, they are great you you can get better pigmentation if you use some fix plus or some other setting spray spray well let's just go over to the swatches so we are going to begin with this road road up here and then we'll take the second road the third and the last one so this first color is basic Sugar is the second color. Let's see, if there we have it. Pre spot. Mama bird. Ragamuffin, I think. This last is called. The second road. This is Lorley. It's beautiful, like a pink color, almost like duochrome. Tickled pink is the next one. Number two on the second road. I see fit. I think I pronounced this right. Look at this pigmentation. Bitty. And 1988. Third road. Flicky. And this is what I have on my eyelids today. Bridges. Beautiful transition shade. Fried. Mm. 
Yoshi. And this one is also like a dual chrome. Rammer Jammer is the last one on this world. And the last world is Alabama. Whiskers. Bubs. Smashly. Beautiful, like green, bluish color. One of my favorites in this palette. And the last one is Lou. And I find this last one kind of harder to blend, but it's a it's a good color. Also. So that was all the sh shadows in this. Like I said, the first... I have many favorites. I think I love these duochromes best. This green bluish color Smashly is one of my favorites. Also this Remy Jammer is one of my favorites. Also, also Larly, this one too is my favorite. My least favorites the colors that I have kind of trouble with is the like I said before this basic it's too much powdery for me I do use it but I have to be careful with this one and also this last blue, blue black one uh, called Lou um, it's a good pigmentation but I kind of find it a little bit hard to blend you can blend it out of course but I think it needs more work than the rest of the colors but I really really think this is a great palette and I think everyone should, if it's possible, have this in your collection or in their collection. I think it's an awesome palette, really really good one. Give a thumbs up if you like these kind of videos. I'm going to do, um, of course, makeup look with this one for you guys. And uh, thank you for watching, see you soon, bye!